Hey everybody, welcome to another episode of Time to Go, and uh, right here today we're here in the sanctuary. Uh, we're doing a little prayer time, uh, and we thought it'd be a good idea to start off by praying for things we're thankful for. So I'm thankful that I'm in this beautiful sanctuary that's nice and warm today on a cold, wintry day. Yeah, I'm thankful that God has uh, given all of us such a, a wonderful community to live in. Yeah. I'm thankful that I'm a better preacher than Pastor Justin. Wow. Um, I'm thankful for my beautiful hair that I still have. I'm thankful I'm not a jerk like him. Wow. This, uh, this has really devolved quickly. Yeah. Um, I guess that's kind of true in life, that it's kind of like a trap that we can easily fall into, where we go from just being thankful about something that we have to to using that as a tool to judge someone else and to compare ourselves to others. I guess that's kind of what the parable is about this week. Yeah, this week we're focused on the tax collector and the Pharisee who come to the place of worship to pray. And the Pharisee starts judging the tax collector, saying, thank God I'm not like this tax collector here. Thank God I've got all my stuff together. And so we hear this parable where the tax collector comes and says, Lord, have mercy, and we think, Maybe the moral of the story is to not be like that Pharisee being so judgy. The problem is when we start doing that, we start falling into the trap of judging the Pharisee for being judgmental. And so maybe there's more to this story than a moral of the story. Yeah, it is kind of a trap there. And there's other traps in this parable as well. It's never quite as simple as you think it is. I think there's another trap on the other side where if you just look at the prayer that the tax collector offers as a perfect example of what the the goal in life is to do and just to kind of focus on yourself it becomes easy to forget that we live in god's world and that we're called to give thanks to god and to depend on god for everything and it becomes easy to forget as we're focused only on ourselves that we live in a world with lots of neighbors that need our assistance from time to time and um we're called to spend some time focused on our neighbors, but just in a way that uplifts them and uplifts community and doesn't tear things down. So this week, we hope you consider all the things you're thankful for and give thanks to God for those. Uh, hopefully, when you realize your blessings, you might go out and serve your neighbors and love them and stay away from all those judgments and just remember the God who loves you and loves this whole world. Uh, but I guess for now, it's probably time to go. Time to go. Have a great week.